So here are a couple tips to get to more balls and hit better volleys. The first thing I want you to think, when you're on court, you wanna make sure, when you're up at the net, you wanna make sure that you are on your toes. Watch, while I'm waiting for these volleys, my heels are not touching the ground. Too many players, what they do is that their heels are on the ground, their weight's in their heels, and it's hard to push off. And then our opponent hits the ball, ah, oh, too hard, too far away, right? Again, if you're on your toes, you're going to be able to push off and pounce more and be able to get to more volley. So make sure you are on your toes while you're waiting up at the net. Your heel should never be touching the ground. The second thing that I want you all to do, I want you to make sure that you move in a V. Watch this, right? So if I have a forehand volley, I'm going to move up here. If I have a backhand volley, I'm going to move up here. What I'm not going to do, and this is where many players go wrong, is they think that they move side to side. If I move side to side, I'm not going to be able to get to as many balls. I wanna make sure that I cut the angle, so you always want to be moving in a V. And once again, if I have a forehand, I'm moving this way. If I have a backhand, I'm moving this way, right? I'm moving in a V, I'm able to get more balls because I'm cutting off the angle. So I want you to go out on court and again, just make sure you're moving this way for your forehand and for your backhand. Look, I'm on the toes. We already went over that. I'm moving this way for the backhand. I am not moving side to side. I will not be able to get as many balls. The next thing that I want you to do, I want you to make sure that you are following the ball. Here's where many people go wrong. Players think after their volley, when they come up to net, they hit their volley over here, they have to come to the middle of the court. Think, I just hit the ball over there, right? So look, I'm right here, my opponent, they can go down the line, I can't get that, they can go cross court, I leave so much space, right? What I want you to do, instead of going to the middle of the court, I want you to follow your ball. So, if I'm going over here, if I'm going to the right hand side, I'm going to hit and follow the ball, right? So look, we're moving in a V, right? We just went over that, I'm on my toes, so if they choose to go down the line, I have it covered here. If they choose to go cross court, I have it here. Okay, they might hit a Rafa Nadal shot, but they're only gonna do that one for every 10 times. Say, hey, good, good shot, carry on. Again, you're gonna win that other nine out of 10. So next time you're on court, again, I want you to make sure that number one, you are on your toes. Number two, you are moving in a V. And number three, you guys are following your volley. So again, if I hit my forehand volley, I'm gonna hit, follow up here. If I hit my forehand volley over here, I'm going to follow the ball over here. Wherever the ball goes, you want to go. Wherever you hit the ball, you want to follow it. Guys, if you guys can implement these tips in your volleys, you guys will be able to get to more balls and hit better volleys. Guys, if you guys have any questions or comments, please let me know in the comments below. Have a good one, guys, and happy hitting.